Hello, dear class two students. My name is Ben, and I hope you are all good. So I'll be teaching your EVS, and today we are going to discuss a new lesson that is lesson for clothes we wear. So you can all turn to page twenty two zero. So students, the name of the lesson itself is clothes we wear. So. Students, as we all know, we have different types of clothes, right? So today, after studying this lesson, we will learn the importance of clothes. Why do we wear clothes? We will also learn what type of clothes we have to wear, depending on different type of uh, uh, depending on different type of situation, occasion, and weather. Okay. So students, let's get started. So students, here we can see two group of friends. Here we also see uh, in the first group we see a students with school uniform, and the second group of friends we see they are wearing a simple homewear clothes. Now students, from here we know that the first group of friends, the first group of Children, they are coming from school, and the second group of children, they are just having fun, and they are wearing because we we know that because they are wearing a simple homewear clothes. So students, just from the clothes, we can identify, right? So students, it is very important uh, to wear different types of clothes, depending. On dif uh, depending upon different occasion, okay, and different weather, because we cannot just wear the school uniforms and go out to play with our friends. Likewise, we cannot just wear homewear to go to school, right? Because in school we have to wear school uniform, okay. So students, why do we wear clothes? That is my question. And that is very important. We all have to know. And class two students, you are very smart. I know many answers. There's many answers in your mind, right? So let's see why do we wear clothes. So students here, we can see some friends here over here. And since they are with umbrella, so we know that it is raining. So students. Um, Clothes we wear because we look good, because we uh, clothes, it covers our body, right? But students, clothes it protect us from rain. In this type of weather, if we are without clothes, students imagine we will get sick, right? So clothes it protect us from rain. Okay. Now students, we can see here it is sun. And from sun we get heat, so students, clothes, it protect us from the heat from the sun. Now students, do you like this? Here we can see an insect, and through insect bite we get all these rashes in the skin. And students. If this type of insects, they really, really like our skin, and they will attack our skin, and after attacking our skin, they will bite us, and we will get this type of rashes in the skin. So students, we have to wear clothes so that this type of insects does not attack our skin. Okay. Okay, so looks like it's very, very cold. Because by looking at this picture, students, we know that it's very cold. So if we are without clothes, then we will get sick in this type of weather. We'll get sick here. We can see here this girl is sneezing, and your friend here is sick. So students, we have clothes protect us from this type of weather that is uh, cold, okay? And it helps us and it prevents us 
from getting sick. Okay, so students, are you all excited to meet your friends? So here, we can see here, these are Abi and Atu, okay? So they are your friends. So students, they, from here we can notice that they are very, very happy, right? Now students, why they are happy? Because they are wearing new clothes, okay? And like Abi and Atu, we all get excited when we wear new clothes, okay? So students, we all get excited when we wear new clothes, right? We really want to go out and, uh, and show our friends, right? So students here, now we can also see your friend Atu in a pink frog. She's looking pretty. Now she's very, very happy because pink is her favorite color. So students, clothes, we all know they cover our body and also it protects us from rain, from cold, from the heat and from insect bite. But above all, uh, we look, by wearing clothes, we look smart like a bee and we also look pretty like a two. Okay? Okay, so student, next, we will learn what type of clothes we should wear when, where, and why, okay? So students, here we can see that it is winter. And here from the picture, we can see that it's very, very cold. So students, it is very important to keep our body warm in winter because it's very cold. Now you can see this guy here. He's covering all his body because he's protecting his body. He wants to keep his body warm. So students, during winter, we should wear a woolen clothes. Okay, so woolen clothes on cold days. So this type of clothes here that you see are made of wool, woolen clothes. So this is a woolen sweater. The sweater that your friend is wearing is, is a woolen sweater. So here, this is a woolen sweater. And here we have gloves, we have cap, hats, which are made of wool. Now students, do you know these woolen clothes, they keep our body warm. So in this way, in winter, we will avoid getting sick. Now, student, it is very, very important to keep our body healthy and fit, okay? Because it is your responsible, it is my responsible to take care of our health, to take care of our body. Because, students, do you know, if you get sick, if you are not well, you will not be able to play with your friends. You will not be able to go out and have fun with your friends. Also students, you will not be able to do your regular activities and you will miss out on many activities. So students, it is our responsible to take care of our own body. So students, these woolen clothes are made from wool. Okay, so this is a wool. And a wool is a fabric that keeps our body warm. And students, this wool is obtained from the body here of sheep and God. It's interesting, right? And it's amazing. Okay, so students, now it is summertime. Now during the summertime, it is very, very sunny. And in summertime, in sunny days, we sweat a lot. So students, we have to protect our body. So during summertime, in sunny days, we have to keep our body cool. So in order to keep our body cool, we have to wear a light cotton clothes. Okay? Now, students, this light cotton clothes, I have given an example here. And you can see your friends here. 
your friend here over here is wearing shorts and a light cotton clothes. Now students, why only light cotton clothes? Because this light cotton clothes, they keep our body cool. And I said that in summer we sweat a lot, right? So all this sweat are absorbed by the light cotton materials. And also students, in summer, in sunny days, we have to remember, we should remember that we have to wear a light color clothes, okay? So students, this light cotton, this cotton material, cotton materials are all obtained from cotton plants. Just like we have studied the wool, right? The wool, the woolen clothes, the woolen material was obtained from the uh, body here of the sheep and goat. Like that, even the cotton material is obtained from the cotton plant. Okay, so students, from the picture, we can see that it is raining. So, how many of you like to get wet in the rain or play in the rain? So student, it is not good to play in the rain because we will get sick. So during rainy season, when it's raining, we should remember to carry and to wear two important things. So students, are you excited? So let's see what we have to carry and what we have to wear during rainy days. So students, during rainy days, like your friend over here, we should wear raincoat and we should carry an umbrella. Okay. So students, this is an umbrella and these are a raincoat, okay? So we should always remember these two things. Umbrella, U-M-B-R-E-L-L-A. Raincoat, R-A-I-N-C-O-A-T-S. So raincoats and umbrella are very important for rainy season okay so students that comes to the end of the chapter so from this chapter we have learned uh, the importance of clothes we have also learned what clothes we should wear when why and where and students we have also learned the importance of our health right so students now it is activity time. So are you all excited? Okay, so students, we have a question here. When do we use the given items? So we have the option number one, students. We see here, we have a woolen sweater. Okay, now option number two, here we see a light cotton shirt. So student, the question is, when do we use the given items? So option one, students, I have said that I told you that the woolen clothes are used during winter days on the on cold days to keep our body warm, right? So the answer for option number one is on cold days. Now students, option number two, here we see a light cotton clothes. So students, this type of clothes we wear during summer because they keep our body cool, okay? Now, students, option number three. Here we can see an umbrella, we can see a raincoat. So students, when do we use umbrella and raincoat? Students, we use this umbrella and raincoat to protect our body, to keep our body dry during rainy season, right? So the answer for the option number three would be rainy days, okay? Rainy days. Now students, the option number four that you see here, it is, we see shorts. We, we see a t-shirt, a cotton t-shirt. So students, when do we use this type of clothes? We will not use this type of clothes during 
uh, winter during windy days. We will not use this type of plots during rainy days. So students, the correct answer for option number four would be during sunny days. Okay, that means during summer. Okay, so students, now question time. So are you all excited? Question time. So students, the first question, the first question is, why do we wear clothes? So students, what, if, what would be the answer for this question? Why do we wear clothes? We wear clothes to protect our body, to cover our body. We wear clothes to protect our body from the heat, from the sun, we, we also wear clothes to protect from the cold and also from the insect bite, right? Now, students, the second question. Uh, why do we wear clothes on cold days? So, students, the answer would be we wear clothes on cold days to keep our body warm. Okay? Now, students, let's see the third question. Third question is, why do we wear to keep, what do we wear to keep our body cool during the hot days? So students, during the hot days, during summer days, during sunny days, we wear light cotton clothes to keep our body cool. Okay, so students, the last question. The last question, students, it is, what, when do we use an umbrella and a raincoat? So, students, we use umbrella and raincoat during rainy days. So, that comes to the end of our question time. So, I'll leave you, students, with a homework. So, the homework for today would be, you can draw any dress or any clothes which is your favorite so students we all have uh, more than one favorite clothes more than two favorite clothes you can have lots so out of that you have to draw two you can draw two you can draw three or if it's only one you can draw one okay so it depends one two or three so you have to draw your favorite clothes and you have to color it using your favorite color so that will be your homework so thank you students in the next class we'll start a new chapter which is going to be very interesting